it's four years ago since I gave evidence in Parliament on 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 uh, consumer protection post EU exit. We still haven't got that strategy in place. We you know we had the green paper three years ago, and we still haven't got the command paper. Uh, and that's it's been ridiculous, isn't it? When's that coming out? Yeah, and and, and and this and this is and this is and this is where this is where you then question the priority given to consumers. Mm. Because if it, it was another topic, another area, and yes, yes, we've had COVID, and, uh, you know, we need to, we, you know, we need to make allowances for that because you know they were, you know, you know civil civil servants and politicians were having to deal with circumstances that no one, no one had ever dealt with, and you know, they kind of, you know, kind of making policy decisions and legislative decisions when, you know, by the time it's gone through, even in a day, the situation's changed. So, so yes, yes, we need to accept that, but we're all consumers. Yeah, whatever we're doing, well, yeah, we're, we're, yeah. we're, we're all, we all spend money, and you know, informed, confident consumers are really good for an economy, and, and that's what we need. We need to see that strategy. We need to say, and that is underpinned. That's underpinned by high quality information. Businesses who who know their obligations and understand their obligations, transparency in the system, and really good quality regulation, and principle based. You get those four right, and. And it's not rocket science, you know. It is, it is rocket science, yeah. And we've got the skills, we've got the competence to do that, you know. Our, 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 our reg- and genuinely, you know, I've met regulators from other countries. Our regulators are amongst the best, and they, and they really are on the skills and competence they have, the tools they have by and large, the tools we have are by and large, right? It, it, it is just really incumbent on the political and senior leadership in this country to give it direction. To say this is what we want this system to deliver, and then say this is the this is the resource we're going to put into it. Now you 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 as the deliverers are responsible for how you deliver that. We're responsible for the outcomes, and if the outcomes don't meet that, we will que- yeah we will question have we got the strategy right, have we got the funding right. But let, but, let, but let's be absolutely clear because if we're not clear, we, we, you know it's like whack a mole, isn't it? You whack or something down, and the next bit mm-hmm. comes up. And that, that's that's where we need strategy. That's where we need clarity and strategy. So we don't have to wait for a Grenfell. We don't have to wait for a Whirlpool. We don't have to wait for uh, you know, a horse meat. We're able to, we're able to intervene. 